Hey everybody, Clinton Kelly here. I think we can all agree that 2020 was the pits. So let's say au revoir to 2020 and say hello to 2021 with a pits party. I'll explain. It's gonna be fun. All right, let's start our party off with a cocktail, a strong one, on the theme of pits. Cherries have pits. What drink has cherries? Old fashions. They're delicious and strong. Start with the rocks. Then take a sugar cube, get yourself some bitters, add about a teaspoon of water. I used to have a muddler. I don't know where it went, so I'm just gonna use a spoon. So when that's mostly dissolved, the liquor. I'm using rye because I feel like bourbon is a little sweet. Now we need an ice cube. Take an orange, get some of the peel with a peeler. Ozzy, give that peel a good twist. And then a cherry for our kids' party. 2020, see you never. Thanks. Mm. What else has pits? Olives have pits and they're delicious, so I'm gonna show you how to make a tapenade that is going to be the star of your charcuterie plate. I like a green olive tapenade, about three handfuls of olives. Nice clean hands. Nice big clove of garlic, a pinch of capers or so, two anchovy fillets. Now I know I just lost something with an anchovy. Get over it. The anchovies are optional. Juice of a half a lemon. This is a strong one, but it's not gonna beat me. Nice pinch of salt, black pepper, and a very precise glug of olive oil. Not super smooth, a little chunky. You still wanna see that it's made of olives. But let's see if it's delicious. It's delicious. All right, so now we have our cocktail, our tapenade. I think it's time to play a game. It's called The Pits, but it's spelled with two T's because it's about Brad Pitt. I found a bunch of pictures of Brad Pitt, printed them out, and I laminated them because I'm a weirdo. But you don't have to laminate them. You can cut them out and glue them onto index cards. So then you pick somebody to be in. Let's just say it's your friend, Becky. We deal out the cards to everybody except Becky. Then Becky pulls a category card. What'd she get? <gasps> your 2020 love. The other players look through their pictures of Brad Pitt and they choose the one that most exemplifies Becky's 2020 love. Benjamin Button Brad. Wah, wah. Better luck next year, Becky. All right, everyone, thank you so much for watching. I wish you all the best in 2021. It's gonna be better. I promise. I hope.